mastering the rhythm, perfecting your timing and pacing and joke telling. Hello everyone and welcome to our series on English language learning. Today we're focusing on storytelling and jokes. Specifically, we're going to take a deep dive into the techniques of joke delivery. It's not just about what you say, it's also about how you say it. So, buckle up and get ready to learn about mastering timing and pacing in joke telling. Timing and pacing are crucial components of any storytelling or joke telling session. But what exactly do we mean by these terms? Timing refers to when you deliver the punchline or important parts of your joke or story. Deliver it too soon or too late, and you might lose your audience's interest. Pacing, on the other hand, deals with the speed at which you tell your joke or story. If you go too fast, your audience might not catch the details. Too slow, and they might lose interest. Let's start with timing. A well-timed joke can bring a room full of people to laughter, but a poorly timed one might fall flat. The secret is to build anticipation but not to let it drag on too long. Here's a method to practice your timing. Tell a basic joke to yourself. Consider a simple joke, like, why don't scientists trust atoms? Because they make up everything. Identify the punchline. In this case, it's, because they make up everything. Practice different timings. Try a pause before the punchline, then try telling the joke without a pause. Notice the difference? That's the power of timing. Now, let's move on to pacing. The pace of your delivery sets the rhythm of your joke or story. Here's a way to work on your pacing. Tell a short story to yourself. It could be a simple one, like, a turtle was walking slowly in the forest. A rabbit ran past, laughing at the turtle. But the turtle won the race because he kept going and didn't get distracted. Experiment with pacing. Try telling the story fast, then slow, then at a moderate pace. Notice how different paces can change the feel of the story. And there you have it, folks. That's a wrap on mastering timing and pacing in joke telling. Remember, practice makes perfect. So, keep telling your jokes and stories, experimenting with timing and pacing until you find what works best for you. I hope this video has been helpful and added a touch of fun to your English language learning journey. Until next time, keep practicing and keep laughing.